แต่ก่อนเข้ารายการดิฉันได้คุยกับแกนนำพัก CNRP ซึ่งเป็นอดีตรองประธานพักนะคะซึ่งก็เท่ากับว่าเป็นผู้ช่วยของสมรังสีอดีตผู้นำแกนนำพักฝ่ายค้านด้วยค่ะขอให้สะท้อนการเลือกตั้งในครั้งนี้ The upcoming election this Sunday is once again it's branded as one-sided election How do you think it will be different from 2018? The big difference is that Mr. Hun Sen will achieve uh, his ambition, which is to put his son, Mr. Uh, Hun Manet, in power to take over the dynasty of the Hun family. This is very, very dangerous for not Cambodia alone, but for the region, for ASEAN. Uh, because you will have another non-democratic country next door to Thailand. You already have a Myanmar, you have a communist country like uh, Vietnam and Laos. Therefore, for us in Cambodia, it is extremely, extremely important for the Cambodian people to have a voice on this election day, the voice that will determine a new path, a democratic path, for Cambodia, as well as for the region. There was an order to bar opposition politicians to participate in running for office in the near future, like Mr. Somrang Si has been banned for 25 years. What about your situation? Have you been banned as well? Yes, I am very much a part of the opposition party led by Mr. Somrang Si, who is has to uh, be the acting uh, president because our president, Mr. Kamsokha, is under house arrest and has been branded another 27 years um, in prison. I myself have served 42 years in prison and just this week got, was given another uh, unjust uh, sentence by the National Election Commission. I will be banned, I am banned already from politics for 20, another 20 years and I can not vote. My name is um, totally erased from the voting list and I cannot run for a election for the next 20 years. This election is under global spotlight and this morning Mr. Hun Sen tweeted his message that he welcomed more than 300 international observers to see how the election is taking place. What's your take about this? These are zombie observers. To observe a true election, it is not about election day, which is already set up for a long since the beginning of uh, 2017 when Mr. Hun Sen dissolved the party of, the, Mr., uh, of this uh, Cambodia National Rescue Party and again prevents um, uh, the Candlelight Party, another strong opposition, only opposition in Cambodia, from running for election. The observers, the real observers, should, first of all, not participate in such an election because that is exactly what Mr. Hun Sen wants. We thank the European Union, the Australians, the US the, um, for not sending up the real observers to the election on, in Cambodia this Sunday.